<laughs> so we've got food expert Nicole Gonzalez in here joining us. Thanks so much for being here. this new terracotta colored duvet cover from Urban Outfitters. I'll link it down below. I love the color. I think it's gonna be nice and warm in this bedroom um, but I also am just waiting for the shams to come in and then I'll wash everything and see how it looks on the bed but for now I'm just using the white one but I think this will look more like cozy and fall and winter vibes. I feel like I want to wear something Christmassy. Honestly, I don't know why I bother putting a shirt on because I'm breastfeeding 24 seven. So I'm always just in my bralette or sans bralette. So we gotta keep the house nice and warm because I'm basically shirtless all the time. If you're a breastfeeding mama, you feel me. I'm just putting away my laundry, which Matt was so nice to fold for me. Fun fact, I hate doing laundry, so it's nice when it's like, oh, you fold it. That's like the worst part. And then I just put it away. Welcome to the vlog officially. It is December 1st. It is legit a snow day outside. What a perfect way to bring in December. And I just thought I would start vlogging today. I know I'm not doing vlogmas. Um, sorry, my hand is so shaky. I have like no strength these days. I know I'm not doing vlogmas, but I still want to film a lot during the month of December to document my favorite holiday and this time of year. I like love winter and snow days and Christmas up until like the end of December and then January everyone's like over it in Canada um so I just really want to soak it all up all the cozy snow vibes I'll show you guys outside I woke up and it's like a, a winter wonderland it's so snowy outside so I think we're just gonna stay inside we might do a little walk around the block or something um to take Cashew outside because she loves the snow um but I think we're gonna try to do some cozy things inside today <music> Good. Oh, cozy. 
Georgie. Gotta move. <laughs> Rock back and forth a bit. Hello. Mm -hmm. She was so needy this morning. Oh my gosh. Yes, okay. Yes, I know, I know. You need all the love. <laughs> Sit. <laughs> Lie down. Lie down. Lie down. Lie down. Thank you. Good girl. Yes. All right, so, by the way, don't, don't mind the white noise in the background. It's just going to be like a thing now in my vlogs um but i got the tree on okay she's exiting all right oh you just want bum scratch this girl like legit will sit on you for bum scratches um anyways we got all the christmas decor up and it looks so christmasy in here um my aunt and my sister chloe actually came over i think it was like i guess a week and a half ago and they completely i felt like they're like little elves coming to help me decorate as a new mom and it was really awesome they came and they helped me decorate get all my decorations out and i am just in love with the vibes in here um so i will <laughs> yes, you... <laughs> oh my god um i will actually insert some of the footage of us decorating uh right now for you guys to see but if you want the full like details of everything i actually have a video from last christmas um of like decorating everything so i basically we did the same thing this year i'll link that video up here if you guys want to check that out because last year i did vlogmas um but enjoy this year's semi montage decorating hold up i am on my way i'm in motion let's go to the ocean yeah let's go outside we can hang out on Beach without freezing, yeah, isn't that amazing? In Christmas times, we'll be chilling and having a good, good time. Welcome back. So I'm just gonna have my herbal coffee. Um, it is, like I said, December 1st today, so I feel like we need to do something to celebrate. And I don't know, I just wanna like bake something. Matt wants to make granola bars uh, since we are finished the ones that we made, the ones from my cookbook. I'm pretty much done Christmas shopping. I did a ton on Sunday the other day, finally, cause it took me forever. With a newborn, it's just like so hard to do anything. You like start a task and then you never finish it. So, or it takes you a week to finish something. So I pretty much have my Christmas shopping done. I have a few more things to do, um, but I'm looking pretty good. And um, yeah, and like I said, today's snow day, so we're not gonna do too much. Uh, not that you can do a lot, A, with a newborn, B, with everyone just like having to stay home more um, this holiday season. So yeah, I figured we might as well just stay in and bake something, and then like I said, maybe go for a little winter walk or something, because it, I don't know, it looks really snowy outside, but I bet it's not that cold. Do you know what the temperature is, Matt? So I'm gonna have this. I think I'm gonna have a smoothie for breakfast, but I'm just gonna hop on uh, my laptop, check in with the team, um, do a little bit of emails, and then make breakfast. You're a pretty girl. She's like, yeah, mom, I know, I'm so pretty.
right, so we decided we are actually gonna make my homemade trail mix granola bars. They're actually from the cookbook. I already have it opened because I wanted to make sure we had all the ingredients. Wow, matches my shirt. Um, so yeah, these are my chewy trail mix granola bars from my cookbook. And fun fact, these are actually the granola bars that we made when I was in contractions, or when I was having contractions with Sage. So uh, fond memories of these granola bars. But we made a double batch that time and they lasted for like two weeks almost. And they were such a great like even middle of the night snack while I was breastfeeding Sage. So uh, we missed them. So we're gonna make another double batch today and then just pop half of it in the freezer and then have the rest of it um, just to enjoy. They go pretty quick. So I do recommend double batching them. Um, so I'm just gonna start pulling ingredients. Matt has sage in the carrier, so he has his hands free, and we're gonna make some bars. So not very like Christmassy, but so good. So we're gonna make them. <laughs> right, do you want me to get ingredients, Matt? I'm gonna tell you that I love you 100 times a day. Tell you that I'll miss you. I'll miss you if you go. Yes, I'm gonna let you know just how much I tell your mama. I tell your papa too. I'm gonna let everyone know about my love. So I really hope you love me too. Yeah, I really hope you love me too. So this is a really easy hack if you have dates that are a little bit on the dry side just soak them in some boiling water for like 10 20 minutes and they'll get nice and soft again I'm gonna pop these into the oven that's preheated at 350 so normally I do this in a food processor but last time I did it in my Vitamix and it worked out really great and especially if you're gonna double batch it um, if you have Vitamix it works too otherwise just use a food processor Okay, I'm just gonna drain my dates. Okay, and we're gonna blend. So this is what it looks like. It should have a nice caramel mixture. This is gonna help everything stick together. again eyeballing Done. I'm just gonna pop these into the freezer to set and cool and then I can take them out and actually cut them into granola bars. Whew, it is definitely a winter wonderland out here right now. Cashew is in her element. She loves it out here. Um, and yeah, we are without Matt and Sage just because we didn't know how the sidewalks were gonna be. Um, it's a little snowy today, so I just decided to take Cashew out to get some fresh air since I'm usually the one that's homebound more since I'm breastfeeding. Do I have a snowflake on my eye? I do. Oh, there's kids everywhere. Okay, I'm gonna have to get her on the leash. But I just love this time of year when it's super snowy, but it's not freezing yet, you know? Cashew's trying to get the hugest stick ever. What are you doing? Okay, I gotta get her on the leash. <laughs> Every time she runs up to kids, I'm like, she's friendly. How is this like not melted? Oh my God, looks like I have a highlighter on. Can you see this? <laughs> I 
Wow, look at this winter wonderland. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Did you lose it? Good morning. It's the next day. We're actually just about to put Miss hmm. Sage down for a nap. And I just finished unboxing this play gym from Love Every. So I'm excited. This has been on my list for the last week to set up so we can do some tummy time on here. Um, I'll show you guys what it looks like when it's actually set up. But it looks so cute and really good quality. And I think this is going to be a fun spot for her to play on. So I just took out the second batch of granola bars. So I'm going to chop those up. But these are the ones that Matt cut up last night. And this is what they look like. You can cut them as big or little as you want. But they're such a nice hearty protein and energy snack to have. Uh, so I'm just going to chop those up. Matt's got her in the snoo. He's trying to do just one arm down, but it's see because she gets fussy sometimes and you put both down right away. Yeah. so it's like maybe have one and she'll she'll be okay and then when she falls asleep well. by the way this thing is the best investment ever i know i'm gonna get questions about her bassinet it's the snoo one it's very expensive um we actually got ours used off kijiji because um, people only really use them the first six months and then they don't need them anymore unless they're gonna have more kids so we got it used and it was basically brand new condition we just like made sure to clean it well and it's been the best thing ever like this is what we use for her to sleep with at night and we we're trying to do at least like one nap during the day in it um, but uh, yeah she's been sleeping on us most of the time so we're trying to get back into the routine of her going in the bassinet so we can at least like both be hands-free um, at least for a couple hours a day but fingers crossed that she actually falls asleep in it because she looks she's looking pretty awake right now <laughs> Cashew officially thinks this is for her. Cashew, that's not a doggy play mat. No, it's her CG, okay? She's like, I get nothing. <laughs> so here is the play gym all set up. This is a little space cover that they have, it's optional. You don't have to leave it on. Um, but I'm so excited to get Sage in here. I'll add a clip of her playing. Right now she's just napping. And then they have these little cards that you can slide in and out. Um, so there's like a little mirror, there's some black and white ones, and then it also comes with this guide to help you for all the different stages. So I'm very excited, and I'll link it down below for you guys if you're interested. But yeah, there's like there's lots of different sensory stuff and colors, and, and it's all geared towards like development. Hey. Oh. Wow. <laughs> okay. Her arms underneath. Wow. Yeah. Whoa. Look, Matt. Hmm? Look, she's staring at it. She hit this. CG. Good girl, you and your sister. Oh, and she's up. All right, I've just been tidying up the house. Matt went to the gym. I'm finally 
drinking my green smoothie. It's like honestly the story of my life. I'll make something. Actually Matt, Matt made uh, the smoothie this morning but I don't end up getting to drink it until like hours later. I'm sure if you're a mom or a parent, you can relate. Um, but I just want to, uh, first off, let you guys know that we are doing holiday giveaways for the month of December. So make sure you are following me on Instagram so you don't miss out. We're supporting local and small businesses and just providing some fun giveaways for you guys during the holidays. So I will link my Instagram down below and the giveaways that are happening. So make sure you follow me there so you're up to date. And that's gonna be it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you guys have a fabulous day and you're having a good start to your holiday season. And I will see you guys in my next vlog. Bye guys. I wanna tell you that I love you 100 times a day, yeah.